Psalm 90 verse 12. Teach us to number each of our days so that we may grow in wisdom. How many of us have, have had the experience where we say, I just don't know where the time went. I just don't know where the time went. Where we've been so busy that we have simply lost track of time. Or the other phrase that I sometimes use is, wow, that went fast. And I think so often we get so busy that we either lose track of time or we simply don't pay attention to the time. From a personal point of view, this has really been sharply been brought into focus by the fact that in less than two weeks, we've got this big move down to Cornwall. And there is still so much to do. Moses, who wrote the psalm, according to the author today in context, are about the years that we have on earth before we die. But I also feel that it applies to how we manage our time and just how mindful we are of the time that God has given us. Now, I appreciate that mind, the word mindfulness is a bit of a minefield for some people, but here I simply want to say that we need to be aware of the time that we have. You know, an example of this, an extreme example of this is Elon Musk, the Tesla and the CEO of SpaceX. He describes himself as being ultra aware of his time, carving up his day into five minute slots. That for me is excessive. And also, I think rather miserly with his time. But, and I'm not sure how many people would agree with me here. I think time is a gift given to us by God. And like so many of his other gifts, we are called to be good stewards of that gift. It's a gift we are freely given. And I think it's a gift that we are to give freely to others. So how do we give up our time freely? Well, when you sit with someone who's not well, or you're on the phone to someone who is pouring their heart out to you, or you stop doing what you're doing, like this morning in the podcast, because your child is crying or asking you to look at something or showing you a painting they did at school. That is the giving of your time. And it shows that we care about the person that you are with. It shows the person that you're with that you love them, that you care enough about them that you're going to give them the time that they need. God has all the time in the world for us. And I think he wants us to share that time with others. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you and remain with you now and forevermore. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord.